What's up, world? What's going on? Knock back with you once again. Day five of Knock Daily. Appreciate y'all being here. Oh, my goodness. Great day yesterday. Great weekend. Yo, having fun in here. Today, I just want to cover something uh, real small that I, that I, I, I like to do is um, uh, flipping samples backwards, but especially in cases where you're using expansions because I noticed that, you know, with Native Instruments expansions, a lot of them are dope. Let's just be real with it. You know, that's just my personal opinion, but I'm sure you guys may feel the same way about it also. But, um, yo, a lot of the expansions are dope. But with everybody getting them, I noticed sometimes I do a track, and even if I flip it a little differently or whatever or program, somebody else might be doing the same one, and they'll have a YouTube video with them doing it. Matter of fact, it just happened recently. I did this track, and... One of the uh, people on YouTube actually did it. He did it before me, but I didn't copy. I didn't even know it, but, you know, it was, um, the track sounded similar because of the sample. So something I like to do is I like to flip samples backwards. Like this kit, for instance, is called the Belief Kit. And, and this sounds right here. Somebody might hear this expansion and be like. Mm. So. It's only so many ways you can work with these joints. Well, I like to do sometimes, besides chopping them up, it, it, you know, I might chop them up also, but I like to just flip the samples backwards. So I'll go into the machine, reverse it, boom. This one, reverse it. So. Oh, baby. Anyway, uh, yo, so just flipping it backwards a little bit, um, add some spice to it. So let me see if I can come up with a track. I actually, I ain't to come up with a track. I actually was messing with this track off camera beforehand, but I'm going to act like I didn't do it and did it live. You know how we, we do a knock daily. I could fake it or whatever. You know what? No, I'm just kidding. But yo, I messed with this track beforehand. But So it was like, I actually moved this pad up here. So let's get that. Uh, make that how many bars? Um, four bars. So let's do it. All right. 
like layering stuff, as y'all know. Something we'll put something for this. will hum out the melodies before I put them in. Sexy joint yesterday, and we got a, a, a tribe of Caribbeanish. I don't like to, I don't like to say it's like Caribbean or dance hall because I don't want to offend those people. But it's my take on what I'm feeling of that delicious art form genre. I say delicious. I love Afro beats and oh man, especially when the ladies are dancing. My wife, especially when my wife is dancing. Anyway, um. I don't want to get in trouble in case you watch this video. Yo, I love Afro Beats. But, yo, that's a joint for the day, man. Just, uh, I just want to put a quick joint together and take this auto tune off and then flip it. <laughs> and remember, flipping it backwards. Or another thing, um, if, you, if you're using an expansion and you make a beat, program a beat, after you, after you save it, like you got a nice little rhythm going, save it first and then skip, go to browse and go to the next kit. And see what it can sounds like. I do that a lot too. Sometimes I've come up with some winners. And sometimes it'll sound like some trash the next kid. But I'll just keep going next. I'll remember what the original was, because I got it saved. But I'll keep hitting next. And I'm like, uh, you know. Hey, it ain't no rush here, man. I'm gonna do this right now. Now, I'm saving this joint. It was 
call it Island Taste when I was messing with it. I'm going to say Island Taste because it's different than what I was doing off camera. Island Taste B. Okay, now I got this. Let's see. Let's go to the next kit. Okay, that didn't work. Anyway. Now. Try something else. Well, actually, I don't have the, the kits aren't loading in here for some reason. Oh, I know why. Because I had it named. I was searching for that particular kit. Now I'll do it. So I can just go. Next. Take the patterns off so we're in here now. Next. Load. Next. See what I mean? And keep going, you might find a vibe. Too much shuffling. That's not bad right there. Let me turn this one down and turn the beat up. Put something else in. To add that other beat in it. Like that pause. Here we go. Mm. That's what I'm talking about, man. When you get this machine in front of you, baby, just learn this joint. I'm telling you, I hear stuff in my head, and I'm so I, I it, yo. I might sound like a fanboy, machine fan. I got I hear stuff in my head, man. I can put it down. I love it. I love it. I hear stuff in my head because I know this so well, and and and. And just hopefully watching me workflow and, you know, like I said, anything you guys want to ask or any questions, I'm here. Just go on the discussion board. I answer the joints, even putting other videos up. Yo, it's all about us building this together because I appreciate you being here. Yo, I'm like, yo, if y'all paying a subscription every month, I'm going to be all out, going all out for you. You know what I mean? So tell a friend, baby. Anyway, but yo, that's why I said you just you, you learn this. You learn this too, whether it's the micro, whether it's machine jam or whatever you know because i'm in the machine realm so that's what i'm talking about npc is dope that's a whole other thing but um you learn the joint man you learn to put stuff down and you know what's going it's going to sound like even before you do certain things you know you, it's like yo okay if i edit it this way it's going to be like that boom so yo i'm just having a good time here man as i always do Knock out. I will see you guys tomorrow. Knock daily. Remember, make your uh, profile picture, load up all that stuff, you know, load it up and hit the discussion board as we continue to build. Thank you to those who joined already. I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace out, baby. Let's go. Mm hmm. Knock out.